Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is X Skyder, doing another commentary for you guys. And today, I'm bringing you a Havana search, but it's not gonna be a gameplay, it's actually gonna be a bunch of segments and uh, search and destroy choices that will maybe help you clutch or just win for your team the round. And hopefully, you know, just help you guys out in the long run because, as I said, I'm here to help you and get you started instead of uh, just trying to teach you. I'll, I'll do both because that's what I normally do. So, uh, yeah, basically, Ooh, I'm so try hard is about to clutch, and I'm going to show you guys some choices he makes, whether they're right or wrong, and uh, what he could have done right or what he did do right. So, anyways, let's get started. So currently, Tryhard is in top red, and as you can see in the lower left corner, he has 36 seconds to plant this bomb and win the round. But, as you can see, he doesn't have a whole lot of time left, so he has to think fast. So, he could have done one of two things. The first one is go in a top red room, and he could have easily looked over mid, watched the bomb just to make sure no one was camping around the bomb, so he would... Make his job a whole lot easier to plant this bomb. And at the same time, he could have gone to highlighted in green, is the top red stairs, go out through mid, pick up the bomb, and plant B right nice and fast, where he might catch the opponents off guard. But at the same time, it could have been a really dangerous move and would have would not have been a good idea. So uh let's see what Tryhard actually really does Time's almost up. so now currently as you've seen the guy has just ran down to bottom red he knows he's top red he switches up his position and now he's red stairs. So as you saw, he was in top red room. He took him out. Now going to red stairs as I highlighted in green before. But now he's in one of these situations. He could go to around to the yellow side. And uh, maybe he'd be over there and take him out quick. Hopefully have enough time to plant the bomb. Or he could just go to the blue side of the room. And gone out to be maybe the guy would pop out there and hopefully he'd just get them up all together so currently now let's see what tryhard is gonna do you have connection is it bad or good connection the next video? I, I think he is but look what he just did like he he got a perfect drop shot on, on mr yellow So as you saw, he currently just knifed the guy by Fountain, and so now the opponent is probably thinking he's going to plant A. Stupid as he is, he doesn't know that the bomb is currently by B. And so try hard. what I really do like about this play is that he currently just grabbed the bomb, not knowing where the opponent was, which is really risky, not looking around for the opponent. He could have been by yellow, but he just goes in there, grabs the bomb, and plants it as soon as he does. So uh, I think that was really a good idea in this play. And at the same time it blew his opponent off. And was it worth it? Let's see. Nice, nice play. So he just currently planted the bomb. He made his way around through yellow alley. And up to top yellow. The opponent really caught off guard, probably is going to be bottom yellow, and probably going to think, what the hell is this guy doing? So, he, try hard camps up here, waiting or trying to sound whore him to defuse the bomb, and I wonder if it'll pay off, so uh, let's see. So now, let's go into my clutch. I know, my clutch, right? <laughs> I'm a boss. So, anyways, currently my teammate just currently died real quick, and my other teammate as well. And I saw a guy bar. I 
shot some bullets in him. He just didn't die. So as soon as that, as soon as that, I just realized that I have been a dot on the map, and that's what people will use to their advantage in search and destroy. I mean, we all know that. And so I currently, after I shoot him and after he eats my bullets, I look behind me just to make sure no one was there. But uh, let's see what actually happened. So as you can see, the opponents were playing it pretty damn slow. I was currently residing by A. Hopefully no one was just, I was just defending the bomb site. And uh, so it's a good position right here to defend A. You really don't know what to, what to expect really in search. So a good position or not, you can kind of see A and whether they're planning or not. And uh, the opponent here decided uh, he was going to push for A. And uh, let's see what actually happens. So as you can see, I just killed an enemy by A. And so his teammate, probably alarmed, went to go look for me as I expected. And uh, I kind of sit in a corner, kind of waiting for him. Maybe he'd cross past me and I'd catch him off guard. But uh, let's see what I actually decide to do. Time's almost up. So I do end up getting the kill and winning the round for us. We did eventually win the game 6-4 to four, if you're wondering. And uh, anyways, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like button. I really worked hard on this. Anyways, this has been X Guider, and I'm out.